Credenza not only creates time entries, it also allows you to post them electronically. Many accounting systems can import these posted timesheets, or you can simply import them into Excel. However, different accounting systems require timesheets to be formatted in different ways, so Credenza allows you to customize the format it exports in to be sure your accounting program can import them. You only need to go through this process once, and then Credenza will be ready to keep track of your time. The Accounting Template section under the Setup tab of the Options dialog is where you configure your posting options. If you use QuickBooks, TimeSlips, or PC Law, just select them here in the list. If you use something else, choose Custom, and then click the Configure Accounting button. A wizard appears that will guide you through the process of defining the features your accounting system requires in a time entry. First, select whether your accounting system requires a header and then whether it requires each time entry to begin with a specific code. If you select Yes, then a box will appear to input this code. The next screen sets your delimiters. First, define which character determines the end of a time entry, and then how the system determines the differences between sections of the entry, either fields with delimiters, which can be specified below, or fixed character positions, which you can also define below. The final stage is to define the fields your system requires. Select the field, choose whether it is required or simply included, and then, if necessary, the format this field takes. Click Add to List, and when you're done, press Finish. Regardless of the accounting template you selected, you need to identify where you want your timesheets to be put so that they can be imported by your accounting system. To do this, go to the Preferences tab of the Options window and click the Time Entry Options button. Click the Browse button at the bottom and choose the folder where you want your timesheets to go. If you created a custom template, this is also the place where you can specify your timekeeper ID. Activity codes can be a helpful addition to your time entries. When you use them, they add a short code to your time entry, which can then be used by your accounting system to classify or analyze the types of work you do on a detailed level. They can also be used to drive special rates for a given time entry. If you want your time entries to include activity codes, check this box under the Setup tab. Customize the list of activity codes using this button. Note that for each item in the list, you can specify the code that is passed to accounting, and if you want, what special rate should be applied when this activity code is used. Some accounting systems use different codes than Credenza's defaults, so be sure to check that the codes match your specific system. Some professionals use task codes in addition to activity codes. If you want these on your time entries, check this box. Once you have set up Credenza to post time entries, post one or two of them and import it into your accounting system to be sure the settings are correct before beginning to post all of your entries. If you aren't sure how to import time entries into your system, watch the tutorial on importing time entries next. Thanks for watching.